Hey everybody, this is Chris. Today we'll be comparing an iPhone 5 prototype I received from an anonymous source to the iPhone 4S in white, uh, the most recent iPhone in Apple's lineup. So uh, if we compare the both, we can see that the iPhone 5 prototype is slightly thinner than the 4S. It is uh, quite a bit longer. The screen is a lot larger, which is great for watching films, playing games. It's not as large as the Samsung Galaxy S3 screen, but that's a bit too large for my taste, so this this hits the spot. It's the same width, and uh, it has a couple of other changes as well. If we take a look at the prototype, you can see that the front-facing camera has moved to the center. It's no longer to the left of the speaker and uh, of course the screen is larger down here we have the home button now speaker speaker grill has changed it is uh, two speakers, a one speaker and one microphone the audio jack has moved to the bottom it's no longer at the top, at the top we only have the hold button and uh, we also have a new dock connector it seems like the dock connector on the 4S is quite a bit larger. If you take a look at this image here, and uh, it looks like this some type of new dock connector that Apple has developed. Um, obviously, that's why I can't plug it in. I don't have this dock connector. Um, we can take a look at the back. We still have the same camera, the flash, Apple logo, iPhone. Um, it seems like it's a prototype since it uh, also has the serial number, the XXXX. Yep. And the back is made out of a matte black aluminum, it seems like. Nice to the touch, it doesn't leave any fingerprints. And uh, I hope it doesn't shatter as easily as the 4S does. And so you can take a look here, I got a nice little bruise here. Not sure if you can see it. Side we have mini SIM card holder. Top we have the lock button. Other side, the left side we have the volume control and uh, silent button or silent switch. Okay, yeah, obviously it doesn't work. I would have to connect it to iTunes if you hold here. iTunes logo will show up, but uh. Obviously, I don't have the cable, so I can't. I can't connect it to iTunes. Yeah, that's it. Thank you very much for watching. Looking forward to the iPhone 5's release. Seems like it will be be, be released on the uh, 13th of September. So, looking forward to that. And uh, thanks for watching. Bye bye.